all seen those crime shows on TV where a couple of detectives get to a crime scene and it looks like nothing bad happened. But then they spray some magical chemical on the ground that can detect blood and bam! The whole place lights up like a Christmas tree. It's called a chemiluminescence reaction. It's similar to what happens inside a glow stick. And today, we're gonna show you how that works with an easy little experiment. All you need is a couple of different chemicals, a vial or two, and oh yeah, some Trace Dominguez blood. What you'll need is a bottle of luminol solution, which is the compound they like to feature on TV, a bottle of hydrogen peroxide, which reacts with the luminol to create that awesome glow, and a container and pipettes to do all of your pouring. But we're missing the catalyst, which is the substance that speeds up the reaction. And what are we using for our catalyst? Trace's blood. <laughs> but first, let's add the hydrogen peroxide to the luminol solution. Dim the lights! So when these chemicals interact, their molecules get a little rearranged, and the reactants have more energy than the products, so that energy is given off as light. There's only a little bit of a glow because there's no catalyst. The catalyst speeds up the reaction. And now for the fun part. We make Trace bleed for science. I'm not looking forward to this. I am. Okay, ready? Ow. Nope. Ow. Hey, there it goes. Bye. Hey! Let's get a little scoop. Oh, look, I'm filling up a little spoon with my blood. So the iron in my red blood cells should cause a catalyst reaction with this luminol. Dim the lights! Ooh, Ooh just a little bit. Cool. That was beautiful. Oh, that's neat. Look at that. So that was a blood reaction. You know, actually it was my blood. Yeah, it was. But let's say you're a criminal and you found yourself in a situation where there's a lot more than apparently I'm able to produce. Yeah, for whatever reason. Just a lot of blood. And around, let's say you know. you've got some bleach too. Luckily for you, bleach can also act as a catalyzer. And that's why in crime shows, people often use bleach to cover their tracks. If Gary Sinise sprayed the scene down with luminol, the bleach would cause everything to glow. So let's try it. Dim the lights. So let's put this bleach in here. All right, I'm excited. You ready? You ready? ready? You ready? Yes. You ready? Oh my God! Ah! That's Dude, so cool. Do it again, do it again, do it again. Ah! Yes. Oh my God, oh my that's God, amazing. That's that was so cool. Yes, that was amazing. Oh my God, that's so awesome. Again, don't go out and commit a bunch of crimes just because we showed you how to do this. And in fact, don't try this at home at all. These are fun facts, people. Let's keep them fun. But anyways, thanks so much for watching D News Labs. Tell us what you think. You can find us over on Twitter at D News. I'm there too at Julia underscore SCI. And I'm at Trace Dominguez. See, See you, you next later. time. Later, that works. Whatever. I want to pour more stuff in there. Yes. Can right. we make more pretty things happen? My fingers hurt.